to Steve Smoker after the uh, Steve Cunningham Amir Mansour war. Yeah. It was a difficult fight to referee. A lot of people would have stopped it in the fifth round when yeah. Cunningham was dropped twice. Um, when he went down the second time, I really had concerns. But he was lucid. And he says, Steve, I'm all right. And I said, Stevie, if you go down again, I'm going to have to stop it. Even though there's no three knockdown rule. And then the bell rang. Okay. So I got lucky. He just he was responsive. He was lucid. And uh, thank God the bell rang. And he was able to recoup. And he came back. Yeah, amazing comeback. Did amazing you, did you, comeback. Did you think it was going to happen? I was just concerned that the bomb would drop again. You never know with a puncher like Mansoor. But I guess his strategy was to stick and move, and uh, apparently it paid off. Yeah, um, the judges all had it for Cunningham. Um, some people ringside thought Mansoor not, you know, nicked it. Uh, how did you think it was? I really, you know, that's one item. When I'm in there with the safety, I really couldn't. All I noticed that what really stood out to me was Amir tired from uh, like six on, six, seven on. I saw a marked difference in his punch rate. So, you know, that may equate to less points. You know, but, but to what round? And then at the end, now that we're talking, how did he recover from Stevie from a 10 7? And by the way, there's the greatest trainer, one of those who've ever lived. That's Don Turner, who trained Evander Holyfield to two world championships. So you're in good company, young man. I, o I only roll with the best. Good night. It was great to see you. All good? Yeah, good. God bless.